Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to organize your form using the virtual column. So in this example here, uh, in our form view, so this is a data entry form. So this first name, last name, email, phone, address, I would like to divide this or to organize this into a tab, uh, tab option or tab view. So I want I wanted to do I wanted to divide this. Let's say first name and last name, it will be in the first tab, and then email, phone, address, it will be in the second tab. So this is very useful if you have a long, long, uh, uh, multiple columns. Let's say more than ten columns, and you don't want your user to scroll to scroll down like this. So you can actually divide that using virtual column. <coughs> Let me show you how to do that. So first of all, uh, you don't need to uh, to break the or to add an extra column in your database. All you have to do is just a virtual column. So let's add the virtual column first. So in the virtual column, so let's say here, uh, I'm going to create this is contact info, for example. So this is the uh, this is I will put this as a label in the first name and last name. Let's say, or let me just put its name, and then here just put like that. <clears throat> Once you configure that, okay, then. Then change this into a show type and here keep it as a page header so, so let's say I'm going to title this let's say uh, a name or something yeah once you're done for that uh, let's create another virtual column which is for the uh, let's say this is for the contact uh, details same is procedure once you're done click done then uh, scroll down to the virtual column that you just created here keep it as a show type <clears throat> then here page header and then put this let's say contact Details. So this is the title of the tabs. Once you're done for that, save. <clears throat> Currently, it's not arranged into tab. So to arrange into tab, go to this view, in the form view, and change this into tab. As you can see here, you have name, and this are the virtual columns that you created and let's arrange the view so column order the first thing that you need to put is the name then under that name what will be the columns so like like that the next is the page header of contact details and then I wanted to display the phone the email and the <clears throat> address let's say so guys this uh, this one is a virtual column that we created okay it's in the first one and then uh, the second one here is the contact details this is also a virtual column a show type type a show type column now, as you can see in the form, we have now here, uh, it's saved as per, per tabs. So this is the name. If the user wanted to go to contact details, they can go here. Okay. So this is how you create or to organize your app sheet form using virtual column. So if you learned something in this video, don't forget to subscribe. Or comments if you have any questions and thank you so much for watching and see you next time.
in my next video.